Hi everyone, I'm here with yet another haul. However, um, even though I've been a haul queen recently, it will be my last haul in a while of interest, I guess, anyway, because I am saving for a CNC cage for guinea pigs and even though they're cheaper than a Starbuck cage, it's still a good chunk of money to save up. So yeah, I'm here with Bambi if you can see her. <laughs> so I'm here with a haul from Bunny Binks Toys. Now, you probably haven't heard of them, or if you have, it's because I shared the link on Facebook, if you're on my Facebook now. I found these through a girl I used to talk to on forums. I found her recently on Facebook, which was really nice. She owns bunnies. And she liked this page and she had pictures of her rabbits playing with these toys and when I saw them I thought wow they're um, really rabbit specific and her, her bunnies really really like them so yeah um, there isn't actually another shop that I have come across that only makes toys for rabbits like specifically and as we all know they love to play and I was quite shocked to find out that some people didn't realise that, um, I better turn the volume down on my laptop if you heard that, <laughs> some people actually think that when they throw things about that they don't like the toys, but that's the opposite, that's how rabbits play, and we all, we've all seen them, if you've got rabbits, them chucking things about, and they sort of get, it almost seems like they get angry with it, but they really like um, rattling things, so this is a, a lovely business card that um, was sent with it and on it it just says um, fun toys for rabbits all designed for the love of bunnies so the re I'll just probably get them out and talk about them as we get them out so this is the overview and um, they come each wrapped in bubble wrap so I just cut that off before we started and it had like a big piece of bubble wrap over the top and all this sort of paper in protecting them so they're really really well packaged so the first thing we've got is this really cute um, like star dumbbell and it's actually called a clickety clack star and they all have just the best names. So that's the size comparison to my hand now. Rabbits seem to have these tiny little mouths, even the giant breeds. Bambi, what's this? What's this? So I thought that would be perfect because Bambi can kind of like fit her mouth into it. She's, look, look at that. I think she's a princess. What's this? What's this? What's this? So that's her half demonstrating. So um, they come with this cute little card on each one, which is fab. I think they'd be perfect for gifts. I might actually put this one away for Christmas because it's star... And are you coming to look? Hmm? It's actually like um, got stars on, and each one of these plastic things are made for parrots. So they're not gonna be chewed up or destroyed. They're pretty durable. I mean, parrots have like the strongest beaks ever. So on it, it just has a little warning about not giving to children, and please check your toy regularly in case it's damaged or missing pieces. So basically, even if you have a massive chewer and they chew through the middle, these plastic bits would be brilliant to reuse on your kebab, like skewer, so you know, let's recycle there and save some money. So I really like this and I'm pretty sure Bambi will like flinging this about, or chewing the box, you know, either way. So that's the clickety clack start and they're about £3 each, I think it's really reasonable, we should definitely support like smaller UK businesses especially one like this where you know she's gone to so much trouble designing these toys um and you can tell that um her name is deborah campbell heath um that she has had these she's had bunnies for over 10 years as house rabbits so she's really like spent time with them and that really shows in the design of the toys now this one is really cute this is a heart clatter rattle which is exactly what it does What's this? What's this? so rabbits 
see how Bambi done that with both of them? She like pulled that up and down. A lot of rabbits. I was actually talking to a friend the other day and she gets her rabbit these and it's because they just pull like her rabbit will sit and just pull these backwards and forwards. Which is really cute. Oh don't. So that's um the heart cut around and I really like this one, it's really cute and I like the way everything has different designs and themes. Like this would be perfect for Valentine's Day or like a super girly cage. It's really cute. And again, if they chew through this part here, which is like I think it's like I forget what it is now. It's a really good quality, like hard papery stuff. Cardboard, I don't know, but it's really durable. If they chew through that, again, if you have a massive chew, you can take all these wooden parts off and just give them it like that or put them on a kebab. So you can actually like reuse this. Oh, what's that? Do you like that? Oh, that's fun. So the last thing I got was something that really stuck out for me because I think Bambi will really, really love it is this last one which is called a hair nom nom <laughs> what a fab name but um there's no glue used in these at all whatsoever so you don't have to worry that um there's any dyes or glues so if you give this to your rabbit or oh, chinchilla guinea pig gerbil dagoo it's perfect for all of them and actually rats would probably love these as well and hamsters if they chew through this to eat the hair, they're not going to ingest any glue or anything nasty. So that's like perfect. I'd love to see something like this in pets at home, really, if I'm honest. You can't really pick stuff like this up in pet shops. They all look like that fake look to them or that synthetic look. So that's the card that went with it, which come off with the bubble wrap, which is my fault because I cut it. Um, but yeah. It's. I think Bambi will love this. I'll probably give her it on an evening right after her pellets and she really likes this compressed tight hard hair and it's really hard. And I think chillers especially, uh, chinchillas especially would absolutely love destroying that. Bambi look what I got you. Look. She's like no I'm on the bed. So as you can see I've handled this a bit and not much like has come off at all so it's really well made. So that's the overview of the three toys I got. Um, I would highly recommend these because of two reasons. They've been specifically made for rabbits and there is no glues, no dyes. Everything's like really good quality, sort of highly made to a high standard. That's what I'm trying to say. And another thing, they're not just... For bunnies, even though that's what they're aimed at, guinea pigs, chinchillas, rats, especially chinchillas who are massive chewers, you could like um, cable tie this to the cage bars and they'd absolutely love trying to get this off. You could give them the hair nom noms and they would spend probably a, an hour or so chewing all the hair off and then destroying the wood. And guinea pigs as well I think, because they're not heavy, nothing's like heavy even though they've got quite a lot of stuff on it so it'd be really easy for the rabbits um, and things to pick up and play with I think actually guinea pigs would probably have fun like rolling this about backwards and forwards and sort of fighting tug of war over it so I'm really happy with these I've never seen anything like them um, obviously pet shops sell dumbbells like this but I've never seen anything made so well or specifically for rabbits um, in mind I think they're fantastic and I know Bambi will have fun playing with them what are you doing look how look how adorable she's I love when she puts her ears back like that she looks like a guinea pig almost what are you doing what are you doing when she is gone when she is gone so thanks for watching um I will leave the link below for the website and the Facebook please like on Facebook and please share the page on Facebook because these small companies, uh, of these people who make stuff like this and go out of the way to offer a product like this is really filling a gap in the market and you know people might complain about, I've heard people complain about postage especially for these smaller companies, however postage here was really really re um, reasonable really cheap actually compared to some. People complain but they have to cover their postage and packaging and Small UK companies are struggling 
places like Tesco, Asda and all these big companies are taking over, especially places like Pets at Home. But smaller companies who go out of the way to make stuff like this for our pets and use natural ingredients really care about the welfare of the rabbit. You know, they should be the ones we support. So yeah, that's my little rant over. There's a big Christmas range coming out, guys. So if you're like me and you go crazy and buy gifts for the people's other friends' pets and buy gifts for your own pets, it's a Christmas range coming out. And apparently last year it was so popular, it sold out really quick, my friend was telling me. So get on there. And if you buy stuff and your rabbits play with them, send pictures and share it on the Facebook page. Um, and let's really support this company because it's so nice. Um... I'm really happy with all of these. I know Bambi will destroy this. So I'll probably put this one away for Christmas because it's super cute and it's a star. And I am doing Bambi's cage all Christmas themed. And this one I'll probably just go in her dining room area outside of her cage because I can imagine her running past and throwing it and stuff like that. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, they're about £3 or just over £3 each or under, give or take they're all reasonable prices and yeah go and check them out guys and even if you don't buy anything please like the facebook page and share it because i've never seen anything like this before and i really hope that they take off and everyone buys from them <laughs> so yeah um so that's it for today like i said there won't be no more hauls for a while because I'm not made of money. However, I'm really, really excited to start like a CNC cage and almost like the journey that is involved in that, adapting it, building it, developing it, and stuff like that. So I hope people um, are excited about that. I have had guinea pigs before, but I'm really excited to get guinea pigs again very soon. So bye from me and bye from Bambi, who is falling asleep, I think. What are you doing? What are you doing? What's that? What's that? <laughs> Bye!